I'm making a video about building a press kit because I looked all over the internet. Or not the internet, rather. Just YouTube. I found none anyways. Well, there's one, but the girl is super annoying. And I don't know. Press kit for a band is basically a resume. If you don't have a press kit, you're probably not going to get paying gigs. Uh, press kits is basically a bunch of your information. Uh, you know, how you got together, press clippings, pictures, demo, stuff like that. Um, how you make it in packages is completely up to you, and, you know, that'll reflect on the band as well. This person here, I don't think it's in English, but it looks like the trifold with the CD. It's got a lot of information up there. That's really neat. I've never seen that before, and I like it. Another way, this is one of the most traditional ways with the, with the folder. And, uh, you know, you put all your information in, bio, CD, all that stuff. And then, essentially, you go drop that off everywhere you want to drop it off to A&R people, management, venues, whatever you think. Um, me, I make them in, like, a form of a magazine when I make them for bands. Um, something like this. This is a band from Collingwood. This isn't done yet. We have to put new pictures in. But uh, this works for... Uh, you can put it on websites and send it digitally as well as if you want to do print it out like a normal magazine it's got everything you want I'll just take you through it step by step and show you basically like so the format here is not the not the issue it's the content inside that's like for the outside you obviously want something uh, eye catching that reflects on your band if you're going to send it out in one of the big yellow envelope I would probably print this on the front of the envelope in the back but I just send it out like a magazine stick a little address at the front that saves on envelope costs, and when you're sending out thousands and thousands of them, yeah, the envelope costs are good. Right here, I put the uh, demo CD on the inside here. Or there's uh, Q QR codes, the codes that you scan with your smartphone, that'll bring you right to the website. Sometimes they like that. I've heard of some people putting uh, USB, uh, little USB sticks inside. Right over here on the right side is the bio, influences, a couple pictures, and a business card of the band. Again, this is just my own little way of putting together press kits. I don't know why black and white pictures, but they like 8 by 8 and a half by 11 or 8 by 10 black and white photographs for some reason. Usually glossy. When I print it, I print it on glossy paper. So. And over here, we have shows and achievements. This band has a lot this year so far, so that made it easy. It's just so that the promoter and venue or whatever has a general idea of what you've done, how busy you are, what kind of stuff you do. And a lot of the times, the venues, they'll know the owners to the other clubs or they'll know the different promoters for the different shows and if they are interested in you, they'll just pick up the phone and call them. And here's a media and professional testimonials. This is for mostly people that aren't in your town and haven't had a chance to read them. And it's just, for example, the one on the side on the right is this band in particular wrote the theme song for the Ontario Winter Games last year. So there's a big article about that and then a few different things from promoters and a magazine clipping. Again, just so whoever you're handing this to gets a general idea of who you are, kind of what people think of you. The thing with the venues is they not only they're looking for a band that's good, they're looking for a band that uh, is going to keep people in their bar and paying cover charges and having drinks buying drinks all night anyways what's next here I put a couple color photos in because I read when I was doing the research I had hundreds and hundreds of different websites with step by step different directions and recipes and stuff like that and a lot of them say that um, the, the more management people want to see the color ones so I just put the color pictures in the end And that would be the back cover, which is just reversed of the front cover. That's it. That was quick. That was painless. Just bio, press clippings, a couple pictures. I'm sure there's a few websites online that will give you like a detailed list. But anyways, have fun.